Magandang araw mga kabosting at welcome back sa ating munting channel. Marco Antonio Barira sinigawan at dinuroduro ng isang gold medalist sa Olympic at former IBF World Super Bantamweight Champion. Hindi nga nakatiis si Barira at sinuntok niya ito sa Prescon. Naging kilala ang pangalan ni Marco Antonio Barira sa mga Pinoy. Dahil ito lang naman ang nagbigay daan para lalong makilala si Pacquiao sa bansang Amerika. Matapos maglaban ang dalawa taong 2003, at nakuha ni Pacquiao ang panalo by a technical knockout sa loob ng round 11. Pero bago pa managlaban si Pacquiao at Barira, nakalaban muna nito ang maangas at malaki ang tiwala sa sarili na kaya niyang talunin si Barira. Ito nga ay walang iba kundi ang tubong Hernando Mississippi USA at naging Olympic gold medalist. Dala ni Kinini Makini ang impresibong ring record na 28 wins, 1 loss and 17 knockout. Naging kampiyon sa IBF World Super Bantamweight title at may edad ito na 30 years old. Samantala naman si Marco Antonio Barira ay dala nito ang unbeaten ring record na 39 wins and 27 knockout at may edad pa lang ito na 22 years old, kampiyon sa WBO Super Bantamweight title na ito na ang panglimang dipinsa ni Barira sa kanyang belt. Pariho ang dalawa sa panahong ito na kilala bilang magaling sa kanilang division at si Barira naman ay napabilang sa mga pound for pound boxer at maraming nagsasabi na siya ang susunod na Mexican star, susunod sa yapak ni Julio Cesar Chavez. Naging mainit ang labanan ito ng dalawa at sa ginawang presko ay nakainitan ang dalawa matapos insultuhin si Barira ng kanyang challenger na si Kennedy Makini. Walang pasabi-sabi ay sinuntok ito ni Barira dahilan para magkagulo ang kanilang ginawang presko. Kaya sinabi ni Kinini Makini na ngako ito na ipapanalo niya ang laban kay Barira na ang kanilang laban ay ginanap sa Great Western Forum, Englewood, California, USA. Dito ay taong 1996 pa lamang. Ito po ang naging highlight sa kanilang laban mga kabusing. Players and who returned uh, to pro basketball just this week with the Los Angeles Lakers. But now to this fight because this should be a corker in the first hard punch landed by Antonio Barrera. And McKinney's in a little bit of difficulty here in round one. McKinney has never been stopped. That bout, in fact, was down in the 11th round and knocked Nasida out. It took him eight rounds to defeat the Irish sensation, John Lowy, in Chicago. Right hand catches McKinney off balance. McKinney answers back. Now Barrera comes back. Crown in August of 1994 to Vianney Bungo that jab to work to good effect. He can follow it with a straight right hand, which is a bread and butter punch for him. But Barrera moving forward, pounding away. Barrera. But right now, McKinney fighting better here in round number two. Barrera sometimes throws the jab almost out as an after. Good counter right hand by McKinney, but now Barrera answers right back. Barrera, a very able boxer. He proved that in his title winning effort with Welcome to Sita. And McKinney getting to McKinney is coming on. No question about it. McKinney enjoying a good fourth round. Chavez trying to counter at times. There's that right hand by McKinney. Good uppercut inside by Barrera. A different strategy for Marco Antonio Barrera. Red hot action here in round four, and here comes Barrera. Barrera with a big rally at the end of the round. Crowd roaring at the forum as Barrera winds up. McKinney again enjoying success here in round number five, but now Barrera, just like he did the last round, answering from Nasita when he scored a knockout in the 11th round. Hot exchange between the two there. Ooh, a good right uppercut by McKinney in close. And Barrera Bantamweight champion Eddie Cook with the two swap blows and Barrera finally just outwilled him. Now this is a tremendous battle of white by Barrera because normally we see him pressing forward always. But now Barrera answering back. Oh, that was a good left hook in close, but here's McKinney. Brutal to watch. Unbelievable action. 
Hard right by McKinney, and a right by Barrera. And the McKinney was giving way at the end of the round, but still dangerous. Barrera with that big left hook in that exchange. Barrera often, when he gets hurt or stung, will come firing back. With the right hand. Barrera says, come on, bring it to me. And McKinney is doing just that. McKinney very dangerous with that right hand. Good right hand by McKinney as Barrera got lazy for a second. Hard combination by Barrera puts Michael. That was a hard knockdown as Barrera comes forward to try to finish McKinney off. And McKinney is down again. Gets up. Big combinations by Barrera and McKinney not punching back. This time he legitimately goes down. Second knock. Remember now the three knockdown rule is in effect under WBO rules. One more knockdown and the fight is over. Barrera with a big combination. Barrera moving forward. McKinney not punching back. Barrera on the verge of a knockout victory. Inside the final 10 seconds of the round. McKinney now trying to fight back. Barrera a huge round. Can McKinney survive? Waiting that he had to go down again. Look at that right hand from Barrera, left to the body and a follow-up right, down went McKinney. And he took the full mandatory eight count. Then, later on in the round, he just gave way. Too many blows by Marco Antonio Barrera, too many shots, right hand punch. McKinney wants to move and try to get his jab going again, but Barrera's not giving him any room. Barrera has him pinioned up against the ropes. McKinney trying to fight off of him. Now McKinney's eye is closing. His left eye is closing rapidly. And he's down again. So winding his arm, they thought he was signaling the fight was over. That was not the case. He was signaling to the timekeeper. To... Another right hand. That one hurt Barrera. Barrera in a little bit of trouble, and he takes a left. And Barrera staggering a little bit. Barrera's in some trouble. That right hand by McKinney, he felt it. And Barrera's in trouble as he staggers back against the ropes. Do you believe this? Kennedy McKinney turning it up here in round 10 as McKinney comes forward. McKinney now with body blows and Barrera in danger of going down. Barrera has never been down out in the eighth and ninth rounds. Has Barrera in trouble and now Barrera answers back. Off the ropes. Good right hand by McKinney and Barrera's mouthpiece went flying out. Barrera again hit with a right and he's in trouble. McKinney answering back in a dramatic turnaround here in round number 10. Kennedy McKinney and Marco Antonio Barrera exchanging punches. Barrera fires back. Absolutely brutal. Earlier tonight, Johnny Tapia retaining his 115-pound WBO title. Down goes Barrera from a right hand. That is an official knockdown, his glove. And McKinney could possibly now get a two-point margin from the judges, although he's staggered with a right hand by Barrera. Bell ends the fans chanting Barrera and Marco Antonio responds to that chant left hook to the body by Barrera down goes McKinney That's a blow to the body that put him down no question about it McKinney in danger of going down again Barrera looking for the finisher one minute to go High drama at the forum. It's McKinney in trouble now in round 12. And down he goes from the right hand. The fight is over. Maganda ang pinakitang laban ng kampiyon at ng challenger nito. Parihong magaling at may magandang patama. Dito rin tayo napabilib sa batang kampiyon. Dahil nagawa nitong suklian ng mga malutong na suntok ang veteranong challenger. Di rin natin makakailan na talagang nahirapan ang batang Mexican na si Barrera. At buti na kagawa ito ng adjustment sa laban. Hanggang ang laban ay natapos sa round 12 at dito nakuha ni Barrera ang panalo by a technical knockout. Hindi na kinaya ng challenger nito ang mga patama ng Mexican champion dahilan para bumagsak ito at itinigil na ng referee ang laban. Panalo si Marco Antonio Barrera at muli na nipinsahan ang kanyang belt. So yan lang muna ang ating video sa ngayon mga kabusing. Maraming salamat po.